Yo, what is up guys? It is Yellowfin and it is time to do another one of those big old pack opening videos. This is going to be the first one after I posted that last one that was like 30 something minutes long and that video did really well. So I don't know how long this one's gonna be, but we'll just see. We got a carbon fiber right now though and let's hope we can get something good. Ultima RS tune up challenge. Let's go, mini electric. Alfa Romeo Dardo and something good. Oh, yes, let's go. Julie had a TCR. That is definitely one of the best cars I could have gotten from that pack, honestly, because it was on my wish list. I have been needing that. Front wheel drive, 101 handling. It's honestly kind of mid though, but still, it was on my wish list, so I will definitely happily take that car. It could be useful in some areas, especially clubs. All right, the Mercedes Benz C11 prelims have ended. And my music popped out of the corner for some reason. Learn the Savannah Way Carbon, though. That's what I'm excited for. Because it's a new update Carbon Fiber. We also get that Ute, which I'm happy with. Getting that Ultra Rare Ute right there. That is a nice one. I definitely fought hard for this prelims to get that dub. But I got it. And so now I am going to get a hopefully a nice car. Let's see that Ultra Rare Ute first. The orange one, maybe. Yep. All right. Good. Now hopefully we can get something good afterwards. Let's see. Hey, I will take that Ute SSV Redline. It's just a faster version of the orange one. That is actually a pretty nice car. I don't think that'll be enough to win the hard tune-up challenge, though. But I will take that. Let's also open up... Oh, they got deals again. Uh, don't know if I'll buy one of those, though. We'll, we'll see. Ceramic packs, though. I've got enough for two. So maybe we could get lucky. Except I'm not sure if I want to open two because I could use the cash for upgrades. Fiat and, nah, Cooper. All right, not too great. Yeah, I think I'll just save the cash for upgrades, I believe. Um, Ultra Rares, though, we got that Holden Ultra Rare Ute and another one. So I will definitely take those. All right, here we go. Actually, I did decide to open up one of the Learn the Savannah Way premiums because why not? <laughs> Let's do it. It's gold, which is kind of a waste, but maybe we can get something good. Let's see. Fiat Marchetta and, ah, uh, nope, FPV 4.6. I already own that, so... Yeah, not that exciting. All right, love me, love me not. Carbon fiber time. The challenge was kind of difficult in the beginning. I did have to upgrade a lot of stuff like that Ford Focus on race two. Like, there is a lot of interesting stuff required to max out for this. That Ford Focus, though, is pretty useful, though. 8.6, 81. 81 handling is actually pretty solid, especially for an RQ23. So it does seem like it'll actually be a pretty useful car in the future. Hopefully, I'll get some use out of it outside of this collection series. That's the thing, though. Collection series, you max out a lot of junk. Oh. Tipo lost. Okay. Looks like we got to switch something up. So we've got our Q. Oh, we got plenty of our Q. 36. We can figure something out. So we could go with the Impreza, then we got 45, yeah, a bar, perfect, because we win that small, easy. We could use that for the medium, or, no, actually, we, uh, yeah, true, because 332 on City Street Small can sometimes be very interesting, especially with Commons. You never know with Commons. Commons 332 actually does sometimes beat 323 on some random stuff. It's rather odd, but it can happen, so we might as well take the safe route. Let's see if we can get something good now. Audi 90 Quattro, 220D. Oh, extra super air. All right, Javelin. Mini Cooper S, and let's see if we get something good. Oh, yes! Tuscan race car. That is a great car. That is very useful. That'll be definitely useful in the next challenge, too. All right, here we go. World Expo carbon fiber time. Let's see if we can get something good. I would definitely appreciate something good. Waterfront drag. Big dub right there, 329. And now let's see, hopefully we can get like a new World Expo car, because the Road Trip Carbon, so it's all of the new World Expo updates. So really, I just hope if I can get something new. That's really what we like to see from these World Expo packs, is a new car. So, Holden Kellyus, already got that in. Ah, uh, dang it, TT. Alright, here we go, time for another Loves Me, Loves Me Not pack. I've just got to find another car, let's use the G-Wagon. Yeah, let's do it for City Streets. I needed a City Streets car, so that'll work. Then we'll use Alpha on Ocean. The Agnes will go there, that, and that. There we go. G63 should hopefully beat the Legacy. I believe it should, even though we got a lot less handling, but we got that 0 to 60 to keep us up. Yeah, so we take it a lead now. The Legacy is catching back up, but yeah, we'll take the lead and we should stay in the lead now. Yep, we do. Okay, good. Take the win there. 
that was the only interesting one. I could have just put like some upgrades into the G-Wagon. It would have been fine anyways. So maybe we could get something nice. Julieta. Detamas a long champ. Tuscan race car. Another one would be pretty nice. Let's get thesis. Alfa Romeo 147. And let's see. Ah, nope. Range Rover. All right, that's meh. Okay, here we go. Time for another enter the Savannah or learn the Savannah way. I mean, car, not carbon, ceramic pack. Maybe we can get a nice car from this. Hopefully a new one. I would definitely appreciate a new one. New Super Air. I don't have sub still yet. Ah, nope. HSV. I already have that. Carbon fiber now. This is from the Veterans Challenge. Maybe we can get something good. This actually was a pretty easy Veterans Challenge in my opinion. Might just be because I have a ton of World Expo cars maxed out. But I did find this Veterans Challenge actually rather easy. Which is nice. It's nice when they're a bit more easy. Because I remember there was one, the Mercedes one, where I could not get the carbon fiber and that kind of sucked. So maybe we can get a nice car from this. Veterans Challenges, I usually have decent luck. But then also I get some crap stuff sometimes. So let's see. It's either really good or going to be really bad. And that is really bad uh, because I already own the Boxster. Alright, here we go. Round 13 now. Let's see if we can get something good from this. Loves me, loves me not. Carbon fiber. We have gotten the Range Rover All Surface All Epic. We've gotten the Range Rover Ultra Rare All Surface. We got the TVR Tuscan Race Car. So now let's see what we can get from this one. If we can get lucky in this one. So far, we're two Epics and one Ultra Rare. And there isn't really that many Ultra Rares that I want from this pack. So maybe we could get another Epic. Another Epic would definitely be very nice. Because I, I do already have all the Ultra Rares, that's the thing. So there isn't really too much of a need. I mean, the Calibra Turbo would be pretty good. Um, I'm not too sure what else will be useful. Or that... Yeah, no, it's really just the Calibra, I think. But let's see. MX-5. Chevy Corvette. Lancia Delta. Alright, and let's see if we can get some... Ah, uh, Aston Martin V Advantage. Alright. Alrighty, here we go. Tender loving car. Another loves me, loves me not. Carbon fiber pack, I believe. Yep, it is. Let's see a thesis. We'll get destroyed by the Punto. Punto is definitely a very useful one for this challenge. And also, I maxed out the 595 Pista, so that would also be pretty useful. It's give, gotten my, I've gotten my use out of it. 124 GT I had maxed out prior to, so nothing really special to say about it. I did have the Punto maxed out prior to as well. Thesis is actually a surprisingly good drag car because of its very high top speed. Or surprising, it's not very high, but it is surprisingly high. And then the Cooper S will win there. And that is our carbon fiber now. Let's see if we can get something good. Really, only ultra I need is that Calibra Turbo. So let's see if we can get it. Prelude. Oh, very early super. Early ultra. Ah, uh, nope. Alpha. And let's see what we get. Hey, there's the Calibra Turbo. I will happily take that car. Okay. 90s carbon time pretty interesting to see these weird little campaign challenges added back again but i will definitely take it because i've got the cars for the job didn't even need to max out anything or upgrade anything we've just got the cars for the job already so let's see if we can get something good from this 90s carbon fiber pack first let's just make sure though if anything loses mazda mx5 should beat the integra which it does Ugh. oh nice to say club sport also takes a dub then here, Virage Volante. Yep, another win. And then XK8 will beat the XKR because the XK8 has some pretty good MRA on it. And now it is 90s carbon fiber time. Hopefully we can get a good car. 90s CFs are rather iffy, so it'll be interesting to see if we do get something good. Because honestly, there's good stuff and there's bad stuff. So let's see if we can get some of the good stuff. S6 and... Ah, nope, we are getting the bad stuff. Okay, here we go. Expo reward. Time to get another Learn the Savannah Way ceramic pack and hopefully get a new super rare because I still need some super rares from the new update. So I will happily take a new super rare. Let's see if we can get one. Plymouth Scam, Sebring, Diplomat, Fluence, and let's see. Oh, yes! For Territory Turbo, I will definitely take that. New ultra rare. That is a lot better than a new super rare for sure. So that will be added to the garage and locked. Definitely maxed out in the future. Very nice addition to the garage. All right, time to win that Lotus Rally car. Round 25. This is a very useful car to have. Definitely really happy to get this one. So I will definitely be maxing it out. 
it's just 99 handling on a rear wheel drive off-road tires car it's going to be game changing i will max it out at some point because this car is actually going to be game changing it'll be super useful in clubs i bet like actually insanely useful for clubs so let's just watch through the rest of these rounds make sure there's no random losses yep Lamborghini destroys the kdm and right here we should win with against the 4gt uh yep yeah easy win against the 4gt all right and boom lotus exchange rgt very nice car to add to the garage and to the collection that's for sure all right here we go i'm going to be opening up three of the one seeders carbon fiber packs let's check out what we can get from this pack because it is a very nice collection that's why i'm going to be opening up all three of them because i can get some really nice cars as you can see ultra rares really it's just the morgan plus four race car is what i'd like but for epics there is a lot of nice epics as you can see i have a lot of wish listed ones like the 911 rsr the two mustang gt race cars the janetta g50 then i've also got the wish listed subaru the audi a5 and those two up top the audi and the porsche slick tires but there's just a ton more of other cars i'd be really happy with as well those ones are just my wish listed so let's see if we can get some good stuff from this pack hopefully just not a bunch of duplicate ultra rares so acura slx honda accord hybrid okay Janetta g40 and let's see ah nope maserati tipa all right that is just like similar to getting a dupe ultra pretty much that car is not that great especially because they nerfed its handling as well so it's now like really not that great it rarely gets any use at least from what i've seen i've never even kept one Janetta g40 again all right let's see what we can get ah oh, really another maserati tipo all right well hopefully this last one can be better because we're only able to get three so hopefully this one will be good nissan omera pontiac not the Janetta. yep not the Janetta. nissan cherry and we are getting a oh yes there we go that is the pull that we wanted Lotus Exchange V6 Cup R. That is a very nice car. One of the best epics I probably could have gotten from that pack. So I will take that. I'll lock one Tipo. Not sure if I'll end up keeping it or maxing it out. But I will have to see about that. But that Lotus though. That is a very nice car that exceeds right there. That will actually be very useful in the future. I know I'll probably get some use out of that. Probably end up maxing it for a finals I bet. Because that I could bet would be a very useful final car it was very useful in the previous finals that i won the bmw m5 cs finals whereas you can see i've got those three four maxed out lotus epics for that finals but that exceed v6 cup r is also a very nice one goes along well with the exceed rgt so i will definitely take that one compared to the other lotus yeah compared to the other lotus it is one of the best ones besides the prize car in that other one which has a bit all right here we go let's win the saline s7 twin turbo let's get it win the prize and complete the challenge so this is the last round i got left already got that exceed rgt this car actually has some really good mra as well i didn't actually need to do any epic upgrades for this final or not this final but well this final challenge really i didn't have to put any upgrades into any epics which was pretty surprising because usually i gotta like drop a fuse in a legendary or max out an epic or something but this one i didn't have to drop any fuses into any of the cars which was actually pretty nice i did appreciate that <laughs> but it's also because i do have some good stuff like the zonda f already has a fuse in it um i have a maxed out charger srt8 i have the prize car corvette and also the lamborghini aventador sv so really there wasn't any issues i'd come up and there we go saline s7 twin turbo added it to my wish list as well so i could have the little hearts fly around it and so yeah there we go that is a very nice car definitely a nice prize car to get really happy with that one goes along well with my corvette zr1 so those will both be very useful i have the corvette and i've got the saline now and also the dodge viper for american prizes i'm i'm rounding up the american prize cars i'm definitely getting a few of them all three of which are very useful as well so i'm definitely really happy with that it's also my first saline too i have the other saline s7 wish listed but getting the twin turbo is even better since this one actually has MRA too. So that is a very nice pull. All right, here we go. Pagani Imola qualifiers. Let's see if we can get something good. Early 2000s road trip carbon. We get that Holden Monero, which I do like because that is a new update car. So hopefully we can get some good stuff. Ford Puma, Chrysler 200, and let's see. Oh, 
That is very early. All right. Oh, Porsche Cayenne S. All right. This could be a really good pack. Oh, legendary. Let's go. The Arash LM. That is going to be changing up my finals hand monumentally, I bet. That is an insanely lucky carbon fiber. I don't think I've ever had a carbon fiber that good. Epic, RQ67, I believe, Porsche Cayenne, and then it jumps to Legendary, and the best Legendary in that pack too, I believe, so that is a really nice pack. I was not expecting that Holden to see it as the fourth card, I was just thinking maybe like Super Air or something, but that was probably the best outcome I could have gotten from that Carbon Fiber, honestly. Besides, I guess, Double Legendary, but best outcome I will happily take. That is a really useful car, the Arash LM. I think it's got like 100 MRA or something like that. Really lightweight as well. So that is a very good pull that will definitely be useful in the finals. That will help out my finals hand because it is kind of lacking. I've got the Ultima Can Am. Um, I've got the Porsche Cayenne already, so that Porsche Cayenne is a dupe. But that Arash will be very useful. And that Holden Monero is pretty cool too. So that is a very nice pull. Definitely add and lock that to the garage. Add and lock the Monero as well. That's the same legendary. I, I got two legendaries in a day now. I got the S7 Turbo today, and I got the Arash LM as well. So that is very nice to see. Wow. Definitely will happily take that. Yeah, and then also the Learn the Savannah Way, the Holden Monero is right there as well. So that's a good car too. All right, here we go. I'm going to be opening up a Loves Me, Loves Me Not Carbon Fiber, even though I've already beat the challenge, but I need the slots and I have the gold, so why not? It's also a good pack, too. There's a lot of really good legendaries. We got early super rare already. Maybe early ultra? Nope, 530D. And let's see what we get from this one. Ah, uh, nope, a bar 500. I already got one of those, so maybe I'll keep a second one, though. It is a pretty useful car. All right, let's... Do we go for another? Yeah, let's go for another. Why not? I could use the slots still. That's the thing. So maybe we can get something good. Because that's the thing. There's, there's really good legendaries and really good epics from this pack. So even though I've already beat the challenge, I don't really mind opening up. Oh, there we go. Another Abarth. Let's see if we can get something else good. Oh, X3. All right. I don't have that yet. So I will keep that for now. But that's the thing. I don't have those cars yet. So, or I don't have some of those really good epics or legendaries. I'll also pop one of these too. Because why not? It's new update. And I haven't really opened up very many of these. I didn't open up the Elite Pack in the beginning, so I've got all this gold. I might as well catch up on it. So let's see. Holden Barina, and can I get something good? Oh, yes! There we go! Ford FPV F6. That is a wish list, so I will happily take that one. All right. Let's open up some more Learn the Savannah Way Carbons, because why not? That last pack was really good. So let's see if we can get some more good stuff. Fiat Panda. Fiat Strata. Another Fiat. Mondeo, all right. Oh, new super rare. I'll take that. I'll hold a Monero and oh yes, we got the one tonner. We got the top eleventh car that I most wanted from the new update, the Holden one tonner. We actually got it, and it wasn't from a ceramic pack either, so I don't have to sell legendary. Ford Falcon TVR 350i, Volvo C70. Oh, another nice one. HSV. Don't have that one yet. The GTS. And let's see something good. Ah, nope, already have the Territory Turbo, so that pack is not that great. Let's pop one more, though. See if we can get something good. We might as well open up all of them. Peugeot, E208. All right. Not a bad car. Lamborghini Yalpa, also not a bad car. Acura Legend, Ford FPV, and let's see what we get for this one. Oh, yes, there we go. Holding Commodore, Cali SV Tour. A very nice one. A car that I've seen everybody pull. So I will take that one. There we go. The, oh, actually, I do have the Monero. Never mind. I don't have the HSV GTS, though. So I will take that one. And the Commodore Cali's V Tour. I will take that one. It's actually got like 70 something MRA. So it's honestly not too bad. So definitely a pretty solid little opening for the Learn the Savannah Way carbon fibers. I will take that. Got the one tonner and the Commodore. Plus, I also got the FPV F6 from that previous pack I opened. I didn't really record those clips too far apart. I saw the FPV and I'm like, all right, we might as well open up some of the others. And it turned out pretty well. All right, here we go. I need some more slots. I've got all this gold. Why not? Let's pop a loves me, loves me, not carbon fiber and see if we can get a big pull. Because there are some very big pulls from this. 962C, Koenigseggs, Jaguar XJR15, 
We got um, Lamborghini Aventador SV, except I already have that car. But there's still a lot of very nice cars. There's also the legendary Subaru Slick tires. I'd be very happy with that. I can get that from the pack. So let's just see what we can get. Or actually, yeah, let's see. Oh wait, yeah, okay. Did just have to check real quick if I was recording because I don't want to not be recording it, but luckily I am. So don't want to not be recording and miss out on this pack. 45, all right, we want to see high, high ultra rare numbers as our first ultra. 51, all right, we want some jumps though. 52, okay, can we get a jump? 52 again, all right, that's not looking that great. 55, that's a solid one. Oh, 55 again, Calibra, a lot of ultras. 62, Elise SC, and let's see. Oh, all right, 911 GT3. I do already have that car, so that is a little bit disappointing. But we did get some nice slots, though. That's the other thing. I have 25 slots, and so I'm up to 48 open slots, so I will take that. Only one new car, actually, was just that Range Rover. And that Range Rover would probably be fused sometimes, so that was actually rather disappointing. All right, here we go. We're opening up another one. Because let's do it. I want a legendary. So let's go for it and get something good. Because I'm believing. I believe in these packs. I feel like something good can come out of them. That's why I keep opening them, even though I've already beat the challenge. There's no reason to. But I believe I'll get a legendary. I am believing hard enough. And if I believe hard enough, maybe it'll happen. Maybe I'll get lucky. So let's see. 595 Pista. Passat. Let's see. Audi 90 Quattro. Alfa Romeo 75. Ford Ranger. All right. Let's get some jumps. We, or actually, we really don't need jumps at Super Rares. The Super Rares don't matter. But let's get some jumps anyway. Okay, 45. Let's get a high ultra. High ultra. Come on, let's start with a high ultra. 53. Hey, there we go. Bar 500. Come on, jump. 54. All right. Higher. Oh, that's a big jump. Epic. TVR Tuscan. That's a dupe, but that's such a good dupe. That means it's either another Tuscan or a legendary. This next pull. Oh, Leventador. Another one. There's no way. There's actually no way. <laughs> I saw that Tuscan and I realized that's the highest old epic in the pack. So it's either going to be my third Tuscan or a legendary. Hey, I'll take a second Aventador SV. That's one of my most useful legendaries I have. So I will definitely take a second one. That is my second duplicate legendary. First being my legendary Cayenne. That's really funny though. That I'm just going to have two legendary Aventadors now at the front of my garage. Hey, I can't complain about that though. That's actually an insanely good legendary. So... I will definitely happily take that. Dang. That's pretty funny, though. Two legendary Aventador SVs. All right, here we go. Learn the Savannah Way ceramic pack. We can get some new supers, though. Maybe an ultra rare would be nice. So we'll just have to wait and see. Maybe we'll get a good car, perhaps. But we got to get through this round first. Let's skip it. There we go. All right. I'll be happy with just a new car. 1990 to 2022. That's interesting. I'm pretty sure... No, the HDT director, I, I think, is from the 80s. So let's see. Premier. Hey, I'll take that. Astro, I'm pretty sure that is a new car. Time to open up some prelims, carbon fibers, Pagani Imola prelims. These packs are basically finals packs. They're close enough. And also, there's just some other cool cars, too. There's a lot more variety in this pack. So going to open up a few, see what we can get. Okay, Saturn view. And, ah, nope, another one-tonner. already got one of those, so don't need that. All right, let's open up some more. Doing it from this approach now, from the other side. Maybe we can get a good pull from this one. Hopefully. I believe, I believe, I bet we can get something good. Let's get a nice car. Jimmy Sierra. Lance Athema. Oh, early ultra. Hey, there we go. Bristol Fighter. That's a very nice epic. 100 MRA on that car. So I will definitely take that one. That is definitely a very solid pull. We'll add that to the garage and lock it. And yeah, I don't need... A lot of Mercedes CLSs. All right, here we go. It is tune-up time now. Pagani Imola tune-up. Let's get this carbon fiber pack that we are rewarded with. Um, actually, I might need to switch out that truck. We oh, we got plenty of our key though. So grab the uh, yeah, let's grab the Audi for the rain, and now we should be fine. Yep, yeah, and yeah, yep. We're all, we're all good. We'll get all five wins pretty easily, I bet. But might as well watch the room. There we go. Beating the BMW at the Arash LM. That very nice car that will be previously, I bet you previously saw in this video. 
Also, SL55 getting a nice win. And then here, Blenheim also getting a nice win. Hopefully we don't get Blenheimed in this pack. Because that would be rather sad if we do end up getting Blenheimed in this pack. Pulling an RQ50. I do need one more epic, though, for my finals hand. If we get one more epic, I'll actually have a really good finals hand. So, hopefully we can get lucky and get an epic from this pack. Let's see. BMW 728i. Honda Odyssey. Acura CSX. Alright. No extra Ultra 528i. And... Ah, nope, S4 Cabrio. I already have that, so that will not be helpful. All right, finals time. Let's open up some finals packs. I need one epic, so hopefully we can get one. Let's see what we can get. Yurama GT, Orlando LTC, Javelin. All right, come on, something big. X5 and a good epic. Oh, all right, AC Cobra. That might be the epic. I'm not sure, though. Let's check out the hand. Let's see what the hand is now with the AC Cobra added. And then we'll also just add some supers and stuff too. Let's see. So AC Cobra will replace the BMW. I mean, it's decent, but I'm not sure. That's a lot of fuse. All right, we're going for another one. We got to Let's go. That AC Cobra is just not going to be enough with the Brera as well. I'd have to max out both those, and I don't have the fuse material for that. So hopefully we can get a bit more of a stronger epic, something that'll be a game changer. Ah, nope, SL55. All right. Well, that one is not going to be a game changer. There are a lot of nice cars, too, that I just want from this pack in general. So I don't mind opening up these packs. Because there is a lot of good stuff. So hopefully we can get some nice pulls along with an Epic. Let's see. Hey, there we go. Audi Allroad Quattro. That is a wishlist car that I've wanted since whatever update it came in with. I can't remember. But that is not going to be useful for the finals, though. However, I will be keeping that. I am very happy with that pull. So let's see if we can get something actually useful. 528i and... Yes, there we go. Best car for the finals, for the rain. That will be very useful. That was the key we needed for this finals hand, I bet. That was the perfect pull. Honestly, that, besides a legendary, but that was probably the perfect pull. I will max that out for this finals. Replace the Brera, throw that in there, and that is looking like a finals hand. Now just gotta max it out. All right, let's pop a times five ceramic because I need some fuse mat for this finals. So hopefully we can get some solid stuff. Just some ultra rares. Nice fuse ultra rares though. Not a wish listed one like the 340R. Because that would be painful. But I'd still appreciate pulling a 340R though. So maybe we can get lucky and pull one. But really right now we just want as many fuse ultra rares as we can get lucky with pulling. So hopefully we get a few. Oh, higher Q rare to start off. 38, 39, all right, 40. Nah, we stayed in the 40, not 39 though. Yeah, a lot, wow, a lot of rares. 41. 41 again, and we don't have very many cards left. 48, hopefully? Hey, all right, I'll take that. I do want to keep the Taurus show, but I will use it for Fuse for the finals. All right, let's just open up some more carbon fibers because I need the Fuse. I have the gold. It's the finals I want to win, too. I would like the Pagani Imola, so let's see if we can get some more Ultra Rare Fuse. AC, and... Oh, another epic, another RS6 Avant. That... That's surprising. All right, well, don't really know what I'm going to do with another R6 Avant. That one will probably be fuse material. I don't really need two, especially because there's there's only like one track set, I think, that has two rain. So I really don't need that. Oh, there we go. Nice fuse. And hey, another nice car. Morgan Air 8 GTN. That one will be kept. I'm not fusing that one away. But I will take that Morgan. That was one of the ultra rares I wanted a lot from this pack because I just want to collect all the ultra rare Morgans. So I will definitely take that pull. All right, let's see if we can get some more nice stuff. TVR, all right, and... All right, that'll be Fuse. I already have that 760i, so I do not need a second one. All right, next pack now. Another one. Let's get some more good stuff. Or some more just nice Fuse. More double Ultra Rares would be nice. Double Ultra Rare, one of which being Keeper. Ah, uh, nope, X5. And S4. Okay, that is fine. We do not need another s4 either so that one will be fused away too can't really be too upset with that all right mikra bronco 2 there are a lot of nice epics though too i would like to pull one let's see alfa romeo gtv and oh yes there we go 156 gta super 2000 wish listed car front wheel drive that one will actually probably replace the ac in the finals hand that is a very useful one. I'm actually happy about putting some upgrades into that Alpha, too. I will definitely put some upgrades into that car. Let's see. Maybe we can get another car. And 
Nah, nope, we got Blenheimed on that pack, but that's fine because we do need some Ultra Refuse, especially now with that new addition of that Alpha Romeo. Okay, let's go add our new additions to the garage. R6, don't need. Fuse, keep, keep. Or no, I, I totally messed up what I was saying. But Alpha and the Morgan are keepers. Everything else is Fuse. That's basically it. Oh, server error. We love to see it. All right, we going for some more? Perhaps, yeah, yeah, there's nothing else interesting, so let's just pop some more. Let's do it. Get some more stuff. We need Fuse, so might as well keep opening some. Hold an Astra. V8 Vantage, GTV, and uh, S1155, all right. Can't really be disappointed, though, if I'm getting what I'm asking for. Another 2000s Road Trip Carbon. Let's see, let's see. Let's get some good stuff. 190E. Oh, no update car, HSV. View, and hey, I'll take it. Another Fuse Mat. That's the thing. I can't really be disappointed with what I'm getting from any of these packs because... Whatever I get, we'll be getting some use. Either it's a keeper, or it's getting fused away instantly. So, I really can't complain. Would like another legendary, though. Ah, nope, another SL55. Alright, I seem to be pulling a lot of those. And the last one. Let's get something, or maybe no, I think there's actually one more after this. But let's get uh, something. Let's get something. Oh, 530D, and hey, I will take that. Hummer H3T Concept. That will be finishing off my Hummer collection. So, I will take that. That is a nice one. Okay. G-Wagon, Audi, Elan, View, and... Ah, another All-Road. All right, that will be Fuse. And that was the last pack now. My first time opening up all 15 finals carbons. Was rather enjoyable. I will add that Hummer. All the rest will be um, fused. But as you can see, where's Hummer? The Yeah, there it is. All of them have been collected. I now am the proud owner of every Hummer in the game. So that Ultra Air, oh, not KT Play. That Ultra Air one will be kept and maxed out at some point. And this is the hand now. It's looking pretty solid. Definitely really solid now. Also dropped a fuse into the Arash LM. So, yeah, hand is looking pretty good. Hopefully we can win that Pagani from the finals. I'd be kind of shocked if we don't. All right, here we go. Let's um, open up some of these um, Expo Collection Battle Pass packs. We got one right here. It's going to be a finals pack. Too bad the finals have already ended, but it's fine. I won the Pagani, so can't really complain. And let's get some nice pulls, hopefully. Because I, I opened up a bunch of these packs, though, so I don't know what better I could get from this pack. But we can see. We can definitely see. Maybe we could do good. Early 2000s Road Trip Carbon. Let's get a nice pull. I still want the Saline S7. So I would take the Saline S7 if we can pull that from this pack. Honda Prelude. Porsche Boxster. And let's see. Hey! Another RS6 Avant. That is my third one. I definitely don't need a third. I already have one maxed out and another one waiting for Fuse. So, or waiting to be Fused. So that one will be Fused as well. But I will definitely take the free Epic Fuse material. Yeah, as you can see right here, I've got three of them. Don't really need three though. Alright, here we go. Another Expo Collection Reward Pack. This one's from the ladder with the XP and... Oh, shoot. I'm dropping stuff on my desk. This one's with the XP and stuff, so maybe we can get lucky with this, learn this Vanaway Carbon. I would appreciate a Ultra Rare car. Nice little wish list. Not a Ultra Rare already owned. Nice little wish list Ultra. That would be pretty nice. Or an Epic. I would... I am keep getting a lot of the Epics, so I would take another Epic. FTE, Sport Wagon, and let's see... Hey, I will take that one. Ford Falcon x Sprint. That is a nice one. I will happily take that car and add it to the garage. So, yep, definitely add and lock that one. Wishlist pull, so I will always be happy with a wishlist. Here we go. Round 62 now of the Battle Pass. Let's get ourselves another Learn the Savannah Way Carbon. And hopefully pull some nice stuff from it. Let's see. Quarter mile is an easy win, and we will skip it on. 888 to 0. My favorite tune, 888. Let's open up this pack and hopefully get some nice cars. Citroen C5 V6, Citroen C6, Holden Astra, and oh yes, Holden HSV GTS. I will take that car. That is a nice pull. Definitely really happy to have that added to the collection. And this will also be the last clip of this video. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this type of content, make sure to like, subscribe, hit the bell, do all that cool stuff. I am Elephant. Thanks for watching and goodbye.